Hey, live from my kitchen. I'm gonna transfer this over here. Oh no, you can see it better over here. Trying to get this um, figured out. I am making tons of vegetables. Making some shrimp fried rice with tons of vegetables. Uh, so I just took everything that I had in my kitchen. I feel like you need to be down. Camera person. Nope, that's not going to work either. I'm going to need a camera person for my cooking shows, right? Anyway, I just moved into this house. We're in quarantine, and I am inspired to cook because... Oh, I need lights, don't I? I'm inspired to cook because... What else am I going to do, you know? I've got this big gas stove, this 16-foot island... And I feel like at my last rental house, I never cooked because um, the kitchen was really dark and I just never felt inspired. The garage was in front of the kitchen and so it was dark. Here I have three skylights, I have a huge island, I have a gas stove. I mean, heaven. Summer's coming. I've got an electrician working on my breaker because my breaker is out. So he's doing that. And while he's getting the part for that, I thought I might as well just cook up. I've been craving shrimp fried rice. And I wanted it to I wanted to do it the healthy way. Um, so I thought, well, I'm, I have all these vegetables in my refrigerator that are going to go bad if I don't use them. So I put together this huge thing of vegetables and I'm sauteing them all first. Then I'm going to put my shrimp in there and then my rice, believe it or not is the seeds of change and all you do is put it in your microwave for like a minute or actually not even a minute you put it in for uh how 90 seconds 90 seconds and it's done and then i'm going to add it to my vegetable and shrimp mixture so here is what it looks like tons of vegetables i've got peppers mushrooms two different kinds of onions um, broccoli, and I'm sauteing them up first, like I said. I've got real butter, sauteing them with real butter in the pan, and you just let the, let it do its work. Washing them first, washing the vegetables, getting them in there. Took a long walk. I posted on my story um, with my dog. I'm so very fortunate. I bought a place. Um, it's kind of like an older uh, retirement community I'm finding. Um, everybody here is older, sophisticated, and all retired. And then here I am, just like, hello. But that's kind of like my lifestyle anyway. Um, because when you work from home, it's almost like you feel like you are retired because you can do whatever you want as far as hours go. And so, and you know, everybody's quiet. Everybody pretty much stays to themselves. Um, so I think it's gonna be real great. I, so far, I've been here a little over a week and I'm loving it. It's quiet, it's peaceful. All I hear is occasional lawn mowing. 
occasional dogs, you know, walking by, barking and stuff. Um, and birds. I put a bird feeder out there. And, um, and then everybody else has a bird feeder, of course, because we all love to listen to the sounds of birds. And you just hear nature sounds, you know, and the sound of my pool. And just, you know, it's been amazing. So I'm really pleased with the area I bought. I, I didn't want to be in a brand new subdivision to where, um, I'm going to get some lemon pepper in there. I'm going to put some lemon pepper in my shrimp here. And then a little bit of lemon pepper on my thing. So I'm going to get some garlic pepper and also put it in my bag of shrimp. And I also have ground turmeric and butter and uh, pepper mixed together. Because that's how, oh, whoops, don't do the side that's big. That's a lot, but that's okay. Good for us. Good for me. Turmeric and pepper. Very good. And then, so I have a whole section of, I'll have to show you uh, sometime. I have a whole thing of spices. And then I use organic, this instead of soy sauce. I use this and I'm gonna add that to my vegetables give it like a soy sauce flavoring and then as, just as these are about done because you know the shrimp doesn't take and i'm just using this i got uh, some wild shrimp i'm going to add that to the side of it because shrimp doesn't take very long to cook and then like i said that i'm going to do the rice in the microwave right now and it would take 90 seconds. I know it's weird. I have a microwave in my pantry. That's the way it is here. So we'll let the, the rice do its thing over there. And then all I have to do is just add it to my mix. And then, oh my gosh, a healthy meal. And I love leftovers. I love leftovers. So I make enough to where when I do cook, I have enough to where I can just warm up um, the meal and have it later, tomorrow or dinner or whatever, whenever I get hungry again, whenever I get in the mood. So make a lot when you're cooking, that way you have lots to warm up. Okay, now I'm gonna take the shrimp and put a little bit more butter. I know ideally it would be better if the camera was face down in here, but you know what? I'll get it figured out. This is my first one in my first house. So, and as you know, I'm always doing everything by myself. So, I saw one of Rachel Ray's yesterday on, on Facebook and I was like, her husband was holding the camera and she was just natural. Oh, no makeup. What did I do? Cancel that. This is so touchy, this, this stove. Okay, it's still on. Now I'm gonna pour the shrimp in on this side. I moved the veggies over. I'm gonna pour the shrimp on. Oh, girl, boy. This is already looking so good. These are some big fat shrimp. I love me some big fat shrimp. Oh my gosh. Turn it up a little bit. It's on low. I'm going to turn it to medium so it cooks fast. And then I'm going to add the shrimp. Uh, mm. Delicious. I love having my garbage can just right there. I can pull it out. And then you can either make, I think I'm going to make, you can make either little street tacos with it, or you can just eat it plain, just with the rice and, 
So you can add some black beans to it. Actually, that's not a bad idea. Do I have some black beans? That's not a bad idea. Doesn't look like I do. Oh yeah, I do. It's not looking like I have any black beans. But this is just that. Seeds of change, change rice, and you just cook it in the microwave for 90 seconds. It's long grain brown rice, so you don't have to feel guilty about your shrimp stir fry. It's actually all pretty healthy. So I had a ton of vegetables that have cooked down. I hope that during this time you're you're just doing some fun things. Like if you've never cooked before, learn to cook. Um, if you've never um, worked from home before, maybe you can find, like check out some home businesses and maybe find some cool ways to make some income from home while you're sitting around. Maybe you have some closets to organize. As you know, I've been moving, so I've had this whole week to just, it happened, this quarantine happened right when I, was getting ready when I was closing on my house, which was really crazy. I never expected that to happen because when I found the house and when I applied for the loan, it was way before the quarantine even happened. We didn't even know anything about it. And then boom, all of a sudden it was, we had a stay at home order. I didn't even know if the movers were gonna be able to come move me. I was just like freaking out. But anyway, it all worked out. And now I'm home, quarantined in my new house, cooking for you. Who would have known? Oh my God, this looks so amazing. So you cook the shrimp until it gets this beautiful pinkish color, not very long, especially this gas stove. And then I'm gonna add the rice to the mixture from this. I'm gonna add some more of this Delicious soy, healthy soy sauce, because I love it. I'm gonna add some more butter, because everything's better with butter, right? Real butter? Mm. So, I'm, wow. I'm impressed with myself. So delicious. And then there, you've got your healthy vegetable shrimp fried rice right in the comfort of your own home. Just mix it up really good. It doesn't have to, the rice is already cooked, so you're just mixing the flavors. Oh my gosh, you guys. I want you to see this. I'm going to hold it up so you can see this. It looks delicious. Look at that. So this is my homemade vegetable shrimp rice, brown rice, stir fry. Hope you'll make something like this at home. And if you do, show me or, or at least comment below and let me know you, you're eating healthy and you're, how you're doing. Bon appetit from my kitchen to your house. It's all done, so I turn it off. Make sure you comment, subscribe, and like this video and share.